so today I'm going to be doing a super exciting video. I'm going to be doing um, another demo and review from an Irresistible Me product. And this time I am reviewing the Automatic Moonstone Steam Curler. It looks like this. And it's really cool. It's very different from any other um, type of hair product I've reviewed on my channel. Just because it's the kind of curling iron where you hold it and it sucks up your hair and does it. So it was really fun to try it out. I've always seen these on like infomercials and Instagram and stuff. And I've always been very interested in trying something out like this. Um, it's very, very different. I was kind of intimidated when they first... Um, emailed me and asked me about doing this collaboration. Um, I love Irresistible Me products first of all. I reviewed different products for them but when I first got this email I don't know I was just kind of like not really sure what to think about it because it is very different from anything I've tried before. It's a little bit intimidating just because obviously and I know how to work a flat iron I know how to work a curling iron but this is very new so I was in, kind of intimidated by it but I wanted to I thought it would be a fun video to try out and I just love working with irresistible me so um, of course I said yes and I wanted to try it and I'm really glad I did because it is um, just a really fun type of you know device that I wouldn't curling device that I wouldn't normally use so I'm really glad I did try it out so um, yeah, so in this video, I'm just going to be kind of giving you a little bit of information about the Automatic Moonstone Steam Curler, and then I'm also going to be showing you, um, how I use it, so a demo. So this, my hair currently, I just did the demo part, so, um, I just curled it with that. So as you can see, it is a bit curlier than what it normally looks like in my videos. It's very fluffy, a little bit tighter curls. So it's just, like, really nice, fluffy curls. Um, I do really like how it turned out. I did time myself when I did it, and it took me about 18 minutes. Um, typically my hair takes me 15 to 20 minutes. It took me about the same as it always does. So it wasn't necessarily faster, but it wasn't necessarily slower. So I'm going to show you how it actually comes, like what it comes with and everything. So this is the box. Really nice. They always have really nice um, packaging and everything. And it has, I love how they always include like lots of um, information on the back that lets you know about it. Um, so if you're wondering, does it have auto shut off? How long does it take to heat up? Blah, 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 blah. You can just look here and it's got all kinds of information, which is really nice. So you open it up and it looks like this. I don't have the, I can have the cord hanging out instead of in it. But yeah, it looks like this. You've got the Moonstone Curler in it. Little thing here, which is used to clean it out. So obviously you don't want to do it when it's hot or when it's on or anything. So you just stick it in here and then you can like kind of turn it around. And then I'll just kind of like clean it out get it all fresh for the next time you want to use it so it's nice that it comes with a little like cleaner and then it also comes with this bottle that you can use to fill up with water and then pour into here oops it's open I forgot so you can just um, pour a little bit of water into the automatic mince and steam curler and then that way it has some water for the steam and you don't have to use the steam it's actually got a setting if you want to use the steam or not I did because I was like I've never tried um, like a steam curler before so obviously I wanted to try the steam but you have the option of whether or not you want to use the steam or not. It also has this little booklet that has information about it. The, all the information that you need to know is in this little booklet. Which I'll go ahead and show you all of the buttons and everything on it so you can kind of get a good understanding of how this works before you attempt to try it yourself. So we'll go ahead and turn it on. That's what it looks like. So you can set do you want it on 450, 380, 410, all that kind of stuff. And then right here, steam on or off. So that's what it looks like if it's on. Obviously, that's what it looks like if it's off. Here is where you can adjust the time it holds your hair for. So 12 seconds, 8 seconds, or 10 seconds. And I had mine on 8. And then here is the curl direction. So right, left, or automatic. And I just said automatic because I want it to alternate um, the direction my hair is curling in. Here it says important. Always use this side facing towards the head. So you want to insert your hair here, not the other end. Um, so always do this side right here. Another feature is the um, 360 degree cord like rotation, which is really, really nice. Um, so if you're turning, you don't have to completely like turn this around. If your cord's twisted or something, it'll just turn with it, which is really, really nice. So just like some quick information about it. Um, it does have an auto shut off. So if you, you know, you use it and then you leave for work and then you're like, oh my gosh, I never turned it off. It's gonna burn my house down. Don't worry about it, it'll automatically shut off. Um, I'm not exactly sure how long, but it will auto shut off. Um, it does have a very fast heat up. Um, so when I first turned on my camera to film the demo part, 
um, I was like, oh, I haven't even plugged it in yet. I plugged it in, started sectioning off my hair, started talking, telling you what I've done with my hair before filming it, and then it was already on. So it's very quick. Most of their products do take under like 30 seconds or a minute to heat up, which is amazing. That's my favorite part about yours, this will be products, is just how fast it takes to heat up. Um, the next thing is the multiple curl direction. Again, that's one of my favorite features of this Moonstone curler. When I normally curl my hair, I will alternate like right, left, right, left, because if it's all in one direction, it kind of clumps together. Oh my gosh, I just realized what I said, if it's all in one direction. Oh my gosh. Um, but anyways, oh my gosh. Um, if it's all going in the same direction, then it kind of clumps together and it just kind of looks, yeah, I like alternating because I feel like it makes it look a little beachier, a little more tussled, and my curls don't clump together. Um, so I really like that that is an option. It's got universal voltage. So I don't really travel far away, so I don't really have to worry about that, but I'm sure that is nice if you do travel a lot. Anti-tangle sensor, which is nice. I was honestly kind of scared to try this out because I was like, it's going to suck up my hair. Like, what if it just like, I don't know, you see crazy videos on the internet that make you scared to try these things. You know what I mean? So I kind of thought like it's going to like rip out my hair or it's going to suck my hair up and I'm not going to get it out and it's going to like rip my hair out. But I didn't have a single strand of hair ripped out. Um, there was a couple times where it would kind of get stuck and I'd have to pull it out. But it didn't tangle and just continue wrapping my hair and like nothing crazy. It worked really, really well. It wasn't scary. It's got different heat settings. Um, so lots of different things that you can kind of decide based on what you like, which is really nice. So um, yeah, so now that you kind of have some information about the curling iron, so now I'm just going to kind of get into the demo and show you how I actually used it and curled my hair with it. Obviously, this is the result. I really like it. Um, I think it is a really good product. Again, if you do like tighter kind of curls and if you, um, you know, want to maybe save yourself the trouble of actually curling it, it is really nice because it does do pretty much everything for you. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the demo because I know that's probably all what you're really wanting to see. I just plug this in. I'm going to turn it on. I'm going to do the medium heat because I'm kind of scared I'm going to do something wrong with this. I filled the little bottle up with some water. So I'm going to put the steam in there. I feel like I'm going to turn this off actually. I feel like you're maybe supposed to do it. I'm going to try it with the steam. I've never used anything like this. So I mean, why not just go all the way and try the steam. At eight seconds. Um, Based on the videos I watched from other people, if you do 12 seconds, which is the highest, you're going to have tighter curls. 8 seconds is going to be looser curls. I like looser curls, so I'm going to keep it at 8 seconds. And I'm going to keep it on automatic, so it'll curl both directions. And I'm going to try and keep it like this and not turn it, because I think the water can spill out or something. So you want to try and keep it level. So it just beeped. I think that means it's ready. So we're going to try it out. So first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and section off my hair. I'm going to be looking at the viewfinder for most of this video, because... It's my mirror. So before, prior to doing this, um, I just washed my hair. I actually just got my hair cut too, so I haven't fixed it since then. So I've got nice fresh hair. Um, my hair is naturally pretty curly and just really fuzzy and crazy. So um, whenever I get out of the shower, I will round brush my hair dry so it dries straighter. Just so that when I curl it, it's like kind of like a fresh canvas and not like already fuzzy and curly, if you know what I mean. Also, you want to make sure that your hair is facing this side, not this side. It has like a little warning note on it. Okay, we'll try right here. Oh, no. I feel like I'm cooking my hair because of the sound it makes. Okay, so that's what the curl looks like. Nice. A little bit. This is actually pretty easy. It's not very hard to figure out or anything. It's pretty, pretty easy. Okay, it's not bad. There we go. It's nice because you don't really actually have to like curl it. You just can hold it and it does a little work for you. Okay. I'm liking it so far. That's what it looks like. Okay, so it's like different than my normal curl, but I like it. Look at that. So easy. Okay, now I'm gonna do the other side. I don't want to get 
too close to your head obviously if you start it here it's going to go a little bit and it's going to be like too tight like too close like kind of pull on your head so you don't want to get it too too close but you don't want it too far away or else you're going to have like a long straight piece I would say like an inch or two away from your head is probably good good starting place so right about here no closer no further but look how perfect this curl is it's like perfect one nice thing with this curling iron is that there are not curling iron curling device i guess is that there's no real there's really like no way to burn yourself which is nice so that's what it looks like so far again pretty tight curls okay so this is what it looks like when i take it out so it's like curl. obviously i'm not gonna like leave it like that i'm just gonna kind of brush through it okay so this is what my hair looks like it's been a few minutes i went and ate lunch um so it's pretty curly it's a lot curlier than what my hair normally looks like um normally have pretty like loose curls and some people did do beachy curls with this curling iron so maybe it's just the way I curled it or something um but I like this it's di obviously it is different than what I normally do but I think if you want you know really curl sorry I'm looking in my mirror which is this way so that's why I keep looking but if you want hair if you want really curly tighter curls I think that this would be perfect for you um if you are like me and you like looser curls um you may want to like flat iron your hair and then maybe just curl the bottoms to get more of like that beachy look. I did go like quite high with my curling so maybe that's why it's pretty fluffy and curly. But anyways, I think that this is a really good product because it's, um, oh it's so hot. Um, but it is really nice. It's very easy to use if you want to try out like this type of curling iron where it just sucks up your hair and curls it and does everything for you. I think that this Irresistible Me one is a really good one to try just because um, it is really user friendly. It heats up fast. I love Irresistible Me products so I kind of talked about that in the beginning of the video but I do think overall that this is a really good product to try out if you like this type of thing, if you like this type of look. It all depends on you know what you want your hair to look like, what kind of you know, if this is your cup of tea. Um, personally, before trying this out, I didn't think I would like it. I was like, oh, this is really weird. This is really different. But um, I actually really did like it. It was really fun to use. It was really cool because it was... Um, I don't know. I didn't feel like I was like really doing as much like it was doing all the work for me, which was nice. So I really, again, like how it alternates your curls um, just automatically. Um, and there's lots of different settings on it. So I think this is definitely worth trying out. Ears of Soul Me is a really good brand. They have really honestly like the best hair products. So the other... So last, my last collaborations with them, I was reviewing their um, flat iron and then the sapphire curler. And I really, really love both of those products so much. Like, obviously, like, they want, you know, they sent it to me so I can, like, review it and try it out and kind of, you know, give you guys information about their products. No payments involved or anything. Um, so I'm not, like, required, really, to, like, continue using it after the video. Like, that's my choice. But I have to say the straightening iron and the curling iron that they sent to me, I use all the time. I literally use them every day. I took them both to LA with me. I have never used another curling or straightening iron since getting them sent to me. Like I literally use them every single day because partly because of the fast heat up. I love the fast heat up. But yeah, they're just honestly such good products. I wouldn't continue collaborating with a brand if I didn't genuinely like them. So definitely check them out. They do have an app as well now. Um, it's not available for Android users, only iPhone as of right now. But definitely check that out. Check out their app. You can like shop on there. Um, check out their website. You also get 20% off with the code get 20 off if they're running a better promo than that if they're doing like 40% off or something that is better than the 20% off then you'll get that instead not it's not stackable so this is the um look I guess I created with it I hope that you guys really did enjoy the video and learn something new and at least have fun watching me try out this new um contraption I guess but please don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up thank you so much for watching also a huge thank you to Irresistible Me for always continuing to work with me I love trying out your products I love your brand don't forget to follow me and Irresistible Me on social media I will link both of our social medias in the description box below along with the link to download their app um and their website and I'll put that 20% off discount code all that good stuff will be in the description bar in the description box um again i hope you guys really enjoyed the video and i will talk to you soon bye